cool so yeah uh, i'll share the screen and let's get started okay so today i want to talk about uh, networking on social media on how to get clients uh, get better opportunities and to increase your network uh, you know uh, drastically uh, in a long period of time uh, to start with this i want to know like uh, there are about how many people uh, 29 or 30 i guess uh, if some of you could you know uh, get on to video just this is all about networking <laughs> if you don't uh, show on the video or we'll keep just talking like this that's all it will keep on going so yeah uh, so these are the table of contents uh, i want to talk about introduction facebook instagram twitter and uh, magic indians that is something uh, literally a little cool uh, i'm not that much on linkedin so i cannot talk about that platform uh, and uh, yeah so in order to uh, you know uh, learn how to network on social media without getting rejected and have a great return on investment for your time uh, you need to present yourself uh, you know in a very good manner your profile uh, your uh, uh, cover pic your profile pics and the bio that you put on to your platform uh, the way you present yourself is very important and uh, let's get on to facebook i hope you can see this cover photo and profile picture of a person called umar ahmed he is a very good friend of mine and he is from bangalore and uh, this guy is very you know he is kind of expert in uh, video marketing and stuff uh, he will do a lot of uh, uh, what to say he does everything uh, in order to in order to what i know uh, he is a very good digital marketer video marketing expert uh, now let's take a look at his uh, profile see if you take a look at his cover photo there is always uh, you know about something that he does exactly what he does for the people he has written that we create elegant marketing videos that boost engagement and sales cinematic video production seamless editing i and animation so we need to uh, write exactly what we do for the people that's how they get to know that you are into something once they get to know about you they'll start uh, you know talking with you they'll start chatting with you they'll engage with your profile and stuff in order to do this you need to have a very good cover photo something similar to this we call this as a profile funnel okay and uh, you need to mention in bio that what you do uh, have, you need to have a very good profile pic and uh, start producing quality content uh, producing quality content doesn't mean that uh, you know you see something interesting and you want to talk about that uh, it's all about when you see something interesting uh, you need to know how well you can present it to your uh, audience it should be relevant and it should be uh, you know worthwhile their time because they are reading or they are uh, watching your video they may be uh, you know interested in watching more about that video or something like that and uh, when it comes to you know networking in facebook what i do is i add people from other communities uh, you know like uh, international groups and stuff the main facebook group that i concentrate on is called uh, click funnels group if you have heard about click funnels russell bronson and things like that uh, i i learned a lot from that group i connected with a lot of entrepreneurs i connected with great entrepreneurs and stuff my life changed like anything after that and uh, engage with uh, you know uh, engage with the right way uh, engage with people uh, with authenticity and honesty it's more about how much value you bring to the other person rather than you get from that person it's more important to know that okay uh, you know it's like uh, here is an entrepreneur and i want to connect with him what i'll do is i'll start uh, you know checking his posts first i'll see what i like what i don't like if i like something i like that post i comment on that something very important on how it resonated with me and when i dm him i'll be like hey hey umar i saw this i saw this recent post of yours where you talk, where you spoke about uh, you know uh, importance of video marketing for online entrepreneurs and it resonated with me a lot because i recently created a video but it not it did not go that well but i am trying to improve myself from there the conversation will start so it's important to talk about themselves first in order to uh, express what you want to uh, you know in order to express what you want to get from them and uh, this is a few these are the few things about facebook uh, let's go to instagram 
when it comes to instagram it has been kind of uh, you know like uh, the fastest growing platform for a long time but right now it's little different but it still has a very good engagement and uh, it's all about uh, coming up with good content and great captions uh in this platform as well you need to be authentic always engage with other stories uh engage with other stories is something that i saw you know like um, there was this guy uh he has uh, his name is mike zeller on instagram uh, i was connected with him on uh, instagram we had a good chat uh, we got on a call we spoke for half an hour and there was a day where i posted something about arnold and his two kids and that guy uh, started engaging with my story saying that aha you know he just laughed uh, and that was a meme kind of thing not meme okay yeah kind of meme from there the conversation starts uh, you know something related to like that always concentrate on what are the uh, posting in stories and try to see what you can post on that and uh, things like that um that guy has made about around 300 million dollars in sales so connecting with that person networking with those kind of people uh, is very important uh, in order to do that you need to be and your profile need to be very good your content needs to be great uh, have right captions don't deviate from the content or the captions it, it should always be relevant with what you talk about on uh, what you do with your life and stuff and uh, when it comes to instagram always check if there's a link tree in their bio uh, link tree is something uh, where you know uh, where people can add their calendly links add links to their website their social media uh, and things like that whenever i see a link tree i'll get to know that whether that person has a call schedule link or not so from there what i'll do is i'll schedule a call with that person uh, i get on a talk uh, you know i'll start talking with them uh, i'll start building the relationship once the relationship has built uh maybe at that point of time we may not get money from them or uh, any other part of things but it sure does help in the long term they may help you get a referral or they may be a great part of resource for you in the long term uh mainly i look for people when i network with international guys uh, it's that uh, i look for partnerships more than anything so i build strategic partnerships with international people in order to how i can grow my business how i can start a new business and things like that and uh, with the instagram it's like uh, when we are starting a conversation don't ever just uh, say you know hi or hey uh, things like that uh, be precise on what you want to talk uh, be precise on what exactly uh, you are looking for in that person so uh, if you are talking on something hey i like your recent post that you posted about something just say that just don't post hey don't leave that because at that point of time most of the entrepreneurs will get messages like hey and they don't respond to that you need to be specific okay uh, and uh, yeah let's go to next okay uh, twitter uh twitter is a platform i really love a lot uh, i've been on this platform for uh, quite some time and i really like what i'm doing or how i'm learning from other people and stuff uh, if you can see there are two profile pictures one is mine it's called it's vintage tier and another one is eric bergman uh in my profile pic if you see the cover photo it just says raw and real since 1998 a 22 year old bruce lee fan talking about business and life a and b that's it so uh, in order to uh, you know create your cover pic for facebook and instagram you need to be more business specific on what you do but when it comes to twitter you need to be more chill uh, what you do like what exactly you are in personal life and stuff that's how they really like you and uh, uh, this guy uh, eric bergman uh, he is someone who made around 50 million dollars with uh, what to say a uh, poker uh, he plays a lot of poker you know with that online poker thing he made around 50 million dollars and he is a very good businessman great business guy but one uh, i saw him on twitter first but by but i got uh, i got connected with him on instagram that was totally different uh, so he tells like that as well uh, so i'll tell you few tricks on what you should do how you should create a profile in twitter uh your cover pic should be something really unique and different in order to connect with other people and uh, always have a bio it says uh, that uh, in eric bergman profile pic if you see 
uh, I mean the bio. I want you to become rich and happy. I made fifty million dollar before turning thirty. If you were rich and happy, would you work to help the world? Uh, th- these are the things. And uh, in my profile, I say that tweeting about psychology in business and how to lead a good life. So what I thought about uh, you know posting in my bio, uh, it's always good to know that it's always good to know that what someone is tweeting about. So I thought, okay, let let me put a bio where I'll uh, tell people what I really tweet about. So I tweet a lot about psychology in business and how to lead a good life. How to lead a good life is something very small part of my life, but psychology in business is uh, a lot that I do. That's how I connect with a lot of people. That's how I connect with international people uh, on a daily basis. And uh, yeah, magic in the end. Uh, so start with talking about yourself. This is, these are some examples of how you can connect with international people. Okay, uh, start with talking about yourself. What you are doing, what your goals or dreams are about. Uh, tell them why you want to connect with them. At the end, uh, tell something about a piece of content they recently posted and what resonated with you to like that post. So start at DM like this, or else uh, there's another option where you can send video messages. Shoot a normal video which you can connect with multiple people and send them. See if it works, and next time change few things from previous video. You can always change things. You can always uh, you know test and trial. Uh, it's always about that, and. Uh, uh there's a new strategy where many people have been using with me but i didn't know until i started using that that's called uh starting a conversation about a mutual friend that we have let's say we both want to connect and uh, we both know uh we both know some other person that i'm really good in connection with uh, okay yeah okay uh starting a conversation about a mutual friend can start like this uh there's a person called nick and there's a person called justin i know nick very well but i don't know justin but i want to connect with justin what i'll do is when i start connecting with justin i'll be like i'm a very good friend to nick uh, we both have been working on a project for this and uh, it's been a great journey he was talking a lot about you justin uh, so i thought about connecting with you some simple random message like this can help you start with the conversation uh connect with people in asking more questions so uh, uh it's like uh, when it comes to dms whether it may be any social media platform asking questions will get you the first reply better than uh, most of the other scripted messages that you can post so uh, let's say they are doing something about uh, growth hacking uh, or they are a very good growth hacker in the industry so ask a relevant question that most people face in growth hacking industry start with that question you will definitely get a reply so once you get that answer uh, try to see that you can ask another good question so asking good questions can really help you a lot uh, with your, if you are a beginner uh, if you have already built a personal brand uh, then a normal message will work to connect with other entrepreneurs so yeah that's it and uh, Yeah, here are my social media links. So you can connect with me on Facebook. It's called Vintage Sir. On Instagram, it's same. It's Vintage Sir. Same on Twitter. Yeah. Shamna, see you there. bro oh my god is talking shamna see you muted shamna see you muted from that time yeah Sorry. okay <laughs> so bishwas sir i question okay uh, bishwas is asking how can we do marketing with our personal name while still maintaining our job should be more student okay name? i'll show you a quick example of what i did Uh, 
so can you take a look at this account guys it's called it's trillionaire boys this is my account uh, business account where i started 2 years back so i uh, when i was you know uh, starting as a beginner i didn't know how to connect with my personal page profile and stuff so i created this account i started connecting with people uh, after some point of time uh, uh, there was a gary v team where they connected with me for this account they started to uh, you know ask if i was able to provide uh, shout outs for gary v and that was a great uh, part of my uh, journey and uh, we worked for 10 days so uh, when you build or uh, let's say if you don't have a personal account if you want to start with a business account uh, you can connect with brands more uh, professionally than with normal people if you want to connect with normal people you need to have a profile uh, you know with the job and stuff i don't think it's more easy Uh, because i have seen my own partner suffered with this thing uh, that's why i am the guy who is face of the agencies and businesses that we do my partner is nowhere near this uh, because he has something to do in his life he is always uh, doing about that so he never couldn't do what i'm doing right now but he works a lot he works a lot on the other stuff uh, this is the example that i can give you guys so yeah uh, i hope that it clears as it also uh, to add to this point i have a i have a, i have something to add on to this point so, okay uh english this is my i'm running my second company and cool. i was i was very visible on the first company when i was running the first company i was very visible and this has helped me to connect with people when i'm starting again when i'm starting this new project exactly so, instead of uh focusing on my personal brand if i had focused only on the brand it would have been very difficult when i started new brand so okay i also yeah, prefer i also prefer uh, investing something <laughs> on personal brand yeah uh, but i'll tell you one thing about this uh, i was not a very big fan of personal brand to be honest mm -hmm. it's like i always wanted to be behind the brand guy you know in order to connect with lot of people behind the scenes and stuff but right now with social media we don't have that option it's like you need to be there in order to connect with people so it's a must and should uh, to do that uh, that's the thing so yeah shraddha uh, what was your strategy what, for this? what was your strategy with uh, okay trillionaire boys so uh, right it's like trillion it's trillionaire boys now but before this uh, the name was called like uh, different thinkers that's how i started uh right now i do not have much of the strategy but uh, there is some other guy who is helping me with uh, you know affiliate stuff uh, this content posting story strategy we have partnered up for a 60 and 40% uh, so whatever the sales we get we divide like that uh, it's a very uh, good uh, source of income if you have something like this and i'll tell you one secret guys uh you have seen lot of these kind of posts on instagram right worldwide there are many motivational quotes business quotes and stuff lot of these accounts have started by north indian kids who are below 16 from a very long time those are the people who are the real business owners that i knew when i was starting like bhaiya kya karte ho aaj dal do kya that's how the conversation will start and it's always great yeah and also next we have haris talking about growing instagram organically so he might have a few points to add to uh growing instagram organically at this point of time uh, we are starting a new account actually we should see how that goes but when i started i was in engagement groups i was in uh, actually uh, not good thing but i was using a bot called uh, it it's extreme mafia or something uh, we had to pay per month some dollars and uh, guy kind of these kind of accounts were in a group of network and we should communicate with each other we should engage with each other that's how we started growing but uh, after using the platform for 2 to 3 months i started seeing the growth of this account like anything it was around just 800 or something when we started uh, in the first month all my friends and things like that but in the few months uh, it started growing for like 10k 20k 30k now it's 40k Mm -hmm. so always uh, you know uh, try to engage with as many people as you can provide quality content uh, don't neglect the captions that's where you can you know add uh, cta and stuff in order to whatever you are looking for from your audience 
and uh, try to connect with as many other accounts similar to you as possible they are the people who really help you get their audience to become your followers so it's a very good way karan has got a question how are you monetizing chalana goes uh right now uh, it's like uh, we are looking at uh, other platforms where they are selling uh, multiple services and products like coaching products uh, so there's a guy who is helping me with all the story strategy and stuff so whenever we post something related to that we make sure that we post a series of stories where the content will be divided into different parts it's like uh, uh, i'll tell you a quick small thing uh okay kind of okay uh, let's say shamnas is a guy who i want to uh, take money from uh, if i want to target shamnas uh, through trillionaire boys what i'll do is i'll post something similar to what uh, shamnas is looking for it may be a product or service i'll take him to a loop where it will be of 7 days where i'll post valuable stories at the end of the last two days it will be something related to where he can get value from through the product or service and at the end of the seventh day i'll show what the product or service is and i'll tell them that if you swipe up the screen uh, this is how you much should be this is how much it will cost for you to change your life to solve this problem so this is a great way there's a guy called uh nikla i'm a uh, so this is a guy from first like my entrepreneur journey started i bought this guy's course if you take a look at his story you'll get to know what i'm talking about okay. now it's totally different uh, previously as I, i was having great stories it will always be about you know different uh, story lines to talk about a brand or service so if you you need to take your audience to a journey where they'll become your customer and instagram stories will help you do that yeah like alex becker yeah like alex becker did exactly